Enjoy Vietnamese grilled pork with lemongrass. This video, I will show you just another way we enjoy this Vietnamese grilled pork. If this is your first time here, I am Melanie with Fish Sauce Mama. Subscribe and turn on the bell for future videos every week. I have received a lot of good feedback about my Vietnamese grilled pork recipe. So today I am back for another awesome recipes that you can enjoy with your family. It's Vietnamese noodle salad with grilled pork. So as so I got my pork ready, marinate and ready to go, I just realized that uh, I was out of gas. Today we're gonna have to do this in-house. I promise it will be just as good. To get your water going, I'm going to uh, cook a pot of water for my noodle. While it's boiling, let me go over with you uh, the noodle. The noodle I'm using is called rice noodle, but uh, you can pretty much use any carb that you like. Um, you can use angel hair or just regular spaghetti. Get your vegetables out and uh, get ready to wash them while the water is boiling. I'm just going to pick a few lettuce uh, to get some green growing and get your cucumber. Everything is washed, ready to go. We are going to cut up the lettuce and then set it aside. I'm going to shred this cucumber because I'm using chopsticks so Water is boiling, so I'm going to dump this whole bag of noodle in and using my best tool. You use yours. I'm just gonna flake this or move this around to separate them so that the noodles do not get stick together. And then just going to set it there for about 12 minutes. I also turn off the heat and let it sit there doing its thing. We're going to rinse it later. In the meantime, you can either go drink your coffee, you can enjoy the beautiful Saturday morning. Or you can go out to the garden if you have a garden to pick up your mint. I love mint, so these are my homegrown mint, and this is garlic chive. I'm going to use some for my noodles. It's going to be so good. Guess what? It's ready. Perfect time. So the noodle is all soft and ready to go, all separated. Going to rinse this and then I'm going to shock it with cold water until it is cool to touch and then let it sit aside to drain. I'm interested to see if you ever had any uh, noodle salad with grilled pork before. And uh, when it comes to salad, uh, people usually think of like lettuce and celery and um, broccoli and tomatoes and whatnot. This is a little bit different. So let me know down in the comment below if you ever had this Vietnamese noodle salad before with grilled pork or grilled chicken. You know what? That's not a bad idea. I'm gonna have to do that video someday. I've made this fish sauce uh, ahead of time. If you're interested, please don't forget to check it out. Add some uh, pickled carrots and some hot pepper for some nice color. Ready to go. It's 11.15 almost and you know what? Lunch is coming so uh, heat up a pot, a really large one so that um, 
I got room to move around, add me some oil, and then just lay these babies in there. If you grill these over the grill, uh, you get that smoky smell. It's gonna be so good. It smells so good inside the house, I promise you. But you don't get that smoky flavor that you know you usually get on from the grill. Uh, do that if you have a grill. If not, don't worry. You can still enjoy this flavor and the the aroma. Once the meat is like halfway done, I will probably go in with some lemongrass and uh, kick it around to get a little bit because I don't want to put in my lemongrass too early. They often tend to be burnt and then, you know, you know, I just lost my lemongrass. So I usually put it in half time. Just a few minutes on each side, these babies are ready to go. Let's assemble. Uh, put in your little noodles. Add you some cucumber, shredded cucumber, some shredded um, lettuce, and garlic chive. I just noticed that I forgot my mint. Later, I just steal it from my daughter's bowl. But you add in whatever you like to add and lay your meat in there. I realize it's so big, so I have to cut it up. I love roasted nuts, so I use some. If you have some, that'll be awesome. And fried onions or fried shallot. Get my sauce ready. This looks so beautiful. That's it, guys, for this video. I hope you enjoy it. And don't forget to check out my other videos on how to grill pork. My family enjoy this recipe a lot. And I've also brought a small portion to share with my co-worker one day and it was so well received. She loved it. So I'm pretty sure uh, you will like it also. Next time when you have a good party, you know, surprise your guests with this awesome recipes. Taste time. I promise you it's gonna taste so good. Mm, drooling. This is a series of videos on grill pork, uh, how to enjoy grill pork, how to make it, spring rolls, grill pork, and noodle salad, and sandwiches. Don't forget to check out my playlist down in the description below. The combination of the meat, the carb, the vegetables, and the fish sauce, it just, it, it, it's, it, it's so good. I promise you, you gotta try this one. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for future videos every week from me. My lobster fried rice recipes also uh, get a tremendous amount of uh, feedback that is so great. So I'm thinking about doing a fried rice uh, series. So if you're interested, comment down below to let me know. Just type yes to let me know because I am so excited about this recipe. I hope you are too. Here is my tips on shredding the uh, cucumber. Uh, usually uh, the traditional way or often people uh, would just chop the cucumber straight from the end and then cut them up, you know, when they're uh, shredded all up. But this is uh, the new way I just found out just recently and I just want to share it with you. You can uh, slice them up and stack them up and uh, shred them up like this but they tend to be slippery so you can also cut them up and just leave a little bit intact and that will keep the cucumber uh, stay together and not slip around this is much easier than slicing around and it's quicker than cutting one piece at a time find this useful and they all pretty much look the same
uh, check out my Vietnamese grill pork videos. I have a very detailed instruction with all the step and details in there and I actually use the grill to do that. So uh, go over there and check it out. This is how I just do it in the morning and I didn't even think about uh, how much I was um, measuring it out because I've done it so often. But I just want to show you my videos. It's so enjoyable, you know, doing, working, um, making food with my family, my son and my daughter running around. So I hope you get this recipe a try and hopefully you yeah. enjoy it. Yes, yeah, it smells so good. Mommy, it smells so good. Yeah, that's so, so, so yummy. My caught. Oh my gosh, that's a lot. Okay. Ah, it smells so, so yummy. Sorry, mix that already. Slowly. Mommy got two teaspoons. Two tablespoons. That's yummy. Yummy? Mm-hmm. Yummy, mommy? Mm-hmm. That's so good. Enjoy. In the meantime, don't forget to subscribe and turn on the bell and check out my other playlist. Cool. Thank you. Bye-bye.